hope you've all enjoyed your first week back at school. Yay, no more homeschool. Ah! Although the mornings aren't so much fun. Ah! It's so lovely to be back with our friends, classmates, teachers, and thank you to all our schools for helping us stay safe and happy. Today is Mothering Sunday. Happy Mother's Day to all the mummies, mums, grandmas, nannies and all the lovely ladies out there. We hope you all have a lovely day. We found some poems about mums and parents. You tell me that you love me when I don't love myself. You're the one who holds my hand when I need the most help. You smile when you're sad to make me smile too. You make my life so much better by doing everything you're doing. That's lovely. Read another one, please. Mum, I know you love me by the way you show your care. You hug me and talk to me softly. When I need you, you're always there. Mum, I'll love you always. From my heart, I want to say, I'm so glad you're my mum. I'll love you every day. Well, we hope you, all you mums, grandmas, aunties, loving friends and all the other ladies out there have a super day have a good week everyone remember to look after each other and be kind see you next week bye, bye. Ah! the lord says you'll be like a child that is nursed by its mother carried in her arms and treated with love i will comfort you in jerusalem as a, as a mother comforts her child isaiah 66 verses 12 to 13 Hi and welcome to a very, very special Kids at Home. It's Mother's Day, a day that we remember, think about and say a massive thank you to our mums and all those women in our lives who treat us and look after us like a mum does. All those amazing things that mums do for us is because of four little letters, L-O-V-E. There is no better day in the whole year than today to talk about and understand a little bit more about what love is. So you probably think that love is all smushy and smoochy and gentle and romantic, but you may be surprised to know that the love God talks about in the Bible isn't like that at all. The Bible says that love is the greatest of all. It's powerful, strong, mighty, life-changing. Love is fierce. And sometimes, because love is so strong, it can cause us some hurt and troubles. And it isn't always easy. Love is messy. It's like spaghetti. It's wiggly and tangled and it's sticky. But you'll be okay because all that messiness and stickiness is always worth it because the love bit is so brilliant. Perhaps one of the greatest demonstrations of love is a mum's love for her children. I love my kids to bits. I love them so much, that fierce, crazy, strong, mama bear kind of love. But even that is nothing, nothing compared with God's love for them or God's love for you. Love is nuts. It's crazy. It has the ability to do amazing things, to conquer sadness, to heal relationships, to change your life when you love and the lives of others as you love them. Remember, love is something you do. I have a simple prayer for you now as I finish and it's one I say over my children at night. I pray that you will always know that God loved you first and that you will always know that God loves you the most. about my mum is that I can trust her with anything and if it wasn't for her our house would have probably fallen down by how badly kept it was. I love my mummy because I like her meals. I love my mummy because she gives me hugs. I love my mummy because she makes me the best breakfasts. Cakes. I love my mum because she gives the best hugs. 
I love my mom because she's always doing silly things to make me smile. Because she gives me up when I'm really sad. I love my mummy because she makes amazing pancakes. I love my mum because she gives me up when I'm I love my mum because she's awesome. I love my mum because she's always happy and excited about everything and she always cheers everyone up when they're always sad. I love my mum because she gives the best hugs and she makes the best cookies. I love my mum because she's kind, loving, helpful and she's always there for me. Love you. I love my mum because she makes me toast every morning and drives me to school. I love my mum because she bakes with me and makes my lunch every morning. I love my mum because she drives me to my clubs and she makes my lunch at school. I love my mum because there's millions of mum because she makes the best cakes and she helps me with my homeschool. My mum because she understands me. I love my mum because she drives me to sports clubs. I love my mum because she reads me a story every night. I love my mum because she lets my cat squish her at night. My mum is amazing, she's so kind and caring, she does a lot for me. because she lets me play video games. I love my mum because she makes me cups of tea. I love my mum because she's caring. I like mummy uh, make me pizza. I love my mum because she lets me go on Fortnite. I love my mummy because she cuddles me very nicely. I love my mummy because she always I cooks me tea. <laughs> She gives the best hugs and she looks after me really well. I love my mum because she let us get chickens and the chick's absolutely adorable. I love my mummy because she does my laundry and she gives me big hugs. I love my mum because she cooks me my favourite meal. Because she does my washing. I love my mummy because she is really amazing and she makes me wagon wheels. I love my mummy because she cooks really well and she's very kind. I love my mummy because she's kind to me and honest and she's always there for me. I love my mummy so much. One hundred and a thousand times to the moon because she cuddles me lots and she's like my best friend and I love her so so much. I love my mummy because she's taught me everything I know. I love my mum because she's always willing to have a chat with me. I love my mummy because she cooks me nice dinners. I love my mum because she gave up so much to raise five children, including me. I love my mummy because she always gives me the best advice. I love my mummy because she always makes me laugh. I love my mum because she cooks the best cauliflower cheese. I love my mummy because she taught me how to work hard and she's very special to me. about my mum was that she was always calm, she loved me and she was really always undemanding. I was very very blessed to have 65 years with her. 
Thank you, Mum. I love how much my mum loves her granddaughters and cares for all of us. The best thing about my mum was that I could always tell her everything. I could be completely honest and whatever it was, I'd always get a smile and a hug first. good friends. Thank you for sending Jesus. Thank you that Jesus is our friend. Help us to love others the way that Jesus loves us. Amen. Amen. Thank you God for the love of our mothers. Thank you God for their care and concern. Thank you God for the joys they have shared with us. Thank you, God, for the pains they've taken away from us. And thank you, God, for all that they give us. Amen. <laughs> 